Hello YouTube, Dalton Beavers here, and today I'm going to be recording a review for WinX DVD Author. Now, this is a free DVD um, burner, and it's actually quite quite good compared to other free ones. Um, it can actually convert video to FOB files, or it could compile a FOB file to a DVD folder, and then in which you can burn the DVD folder to a disk. But it's a lot easier and simpler to just burn all the files straight to the DVD and skipping these steps. Although they're useful for certain jobs, certain requirements, but they're not really essential. Anyways, to use the program, you just click this button right here. Now, it's very simple. It looks complicated, but it's not. To add a file, you simply come over here to the Add Clips. And I'm going to add this video of my dog, Mr. Wiggles. Yes, Mr. Wiggles. Um, I actually like this menu system because you could set up the files differently. And it's different than most um, video compilers and video DVD authors. But I like it. It's not, not too bad. Um, this one stands out, though, because you can actually add subtitle files, which not many DVD authors allow or can even do. But this one's very nice. It can even add different types of languages. And you can have 4 to 3 standard def or widescreen HD. Um, all you got to do is click next and you begin the second one. This is interesting, really. Um, the video is going to be your play function, so you can make it as large as you want. I'm just going to make it where it needs to be, to where it fits the frame 720p. And then I'm going to place it right here at the top. The back button's going to go right here. You can add a chapter menu. This movie's only going to have one chapter. I think it automatically does it for you. But since this is such a small movie, it's like 30 seconds long. It's just going to do it by itself. So I'm just going to tinker around with this. You can add music if you'd like. You could set up the chapter menu. You can even add different hours and segments of uh, how you want to split the movie up, different backgrounds. You can make your own, you can use your own backgrounds for uh, for the menus. I'll use the Joker for this one. And it's actually really, just really nice. Now, um, I'm recording in 720p, so it's hard for me to navigate this thing. <laughs> but, um... Hang on. Let me just move my taskbar down. All right. Click next. And it brings up I already have a DVD in my computer. You have to have a blank one if you guys have never made a DVD before and I always use higher video quality even though it takes a while but it works better all you do is select where your DVD is and then click start and it burns it to the DVD and I'll come back to you when this gets done it shouldn't take too long alright YouTube I am back it just finished um, once it finishes it automatically spits the disc out so I'm going to close out of the program and just put the disk back in so that you can see how it works. Um, play the DVD movie. Here's your menu. Press play. There's the video. And it works pretty good. Um, again, it's free. So, if you don't feel like paying for it, there you go. Um, in order to get it, you pull up your browser. I'm going to have the links to the download um, in the description below. But the website is WinX, not Winx.
<laughs> DVD.com. They have a bunch of products. I'm going to re be reviewing DVD Ripper and DVD Video Converter, but those two cost money. To get the free one, go to to get the free author, go to products. Scroll down, and it'll be at this one right here, WinX DVD Author. Just download it. Download should not take you too long. Double click the installation file. Click OK. Click Next. Accept. Next. 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 And install. And that's pretty much it. Uh, it's been Dalton Beavers. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up this video, comment, and uh, see you next time. Later.